Already have one? Express yourself to Tiny Mushroom Sign Shop. Signage-based company providing services such as final decals, business cards, graphic design, banners, flyers, and more. So whatever your needs are, come visit our professionals at Tiny Mushroom Sign Shop at 605 North Callow in Bremerton. To set up an appointment and to see how Tiny Mushroom Sign Shop can help you, call us at 360-479-9090. Express yourself with Tiny Mushroom Sign Shop. All right, welcome back to the Rick Palace here at halftime. It is the Wildcats for their biggest lead of the night. So they get nine. He took that with 20 seconds to go here in the first half. And held the hamsters at arm's length most of this basketball game. Big scores for the, the Wildcats first half. Deontay Dixon with 10. Ruth Wilson with four. Jameer Johnson with four. Kanye Tater has eight. And Marquise Gursky has five for the Bremerton Wildcats. For the PB Hamsters, Trey Fisher leads the way with 10. Ryan Pearson with six, two each for Trevor Brown, two each for Andrew Blackmore, and Isaiah Kahana running out the scoring for the, the Hamsters in the first half. So as we get sec for second half action, at 20 minutes on the clock, Hamsters win bounds right in front of us. Is hopping up and down is Andrew Blackmore. And here we are. The Hampshire's going from right to our left to start things off here in the second half. It's a free throw line to Burrell. Tries one from 16 off the mark, no good. The ball tapped out. Here in hands of Williams and streaks out of backcourt. Cut off at the free throw line. He'll peel out, get it to Tyus Smith, who starts the soft second half. He just passed, jabbed away, and picked him off the floor by Fisher. Had a man wide open down the floor. It's Castillo, did not see him. Then he has his pocket picked by Smith. The Kanye Tater goes up. Good one to go, put two hands to pack him down, but he only had to settle for letting it in is uh, Carnier Tater. We come back the other day, other way, the ball jabbed out of play. The answers will inbound, trying to get improved to two and one. Here's in trouble. As cut off was Castillo. Out on top to Burrell. Now back to Castillo. Fires one for three. Out to Mark. No good. Nice defensive positioning inside. He'll turn and twist and fire. Andrew Blackmore. That can't get that offensive rebound to go down. And here's Deontay Dixon. Steps back from long range from 22. Out to Mark. No good. Blackmore with a rebound. Or Pearson with a rebound. Good in the Fisher. Finds himself up open for 15 as the shot blocked in his face by Dixon. Drowned in by Gursky. He fires one from 16. Back iron, no good. Fisher with the defensive rebound. Will slow things down and cut off as it comes out of backcourt by Williams. Jab to be away by Williams. Who's a pesky little bug is Williams. And uh, again, in the final try to jab the ball away, Williams whistled for the foul. Trey Fisher, North Mason Bulldog. Former up, one bounds right in front of us. Gets it out on top to Kanye Tater on him defensively. Let's get over to Fisher, working against Williams. Tries baseline left, uses the right hand and scores. Nice job by, by Trey Fisher. Gets his 12th point of the contest. Thirty-three twenty-four. Back to a nine point lead and, and a turnover by Deontay Dixon. Not agreeing with the call. What else is new for Deontay Dixon? He doesn't like any call that goes against him. He will step out. Rupe Wilson will step in. And he's talking things over with, uh, and there's a technical foul gonna be called on Deontay Dixon refusing to let it go. Draws a technical foul and, and uh, that's his first of the game. He's still chirping on the bench as Deontay Dixon. Trevor Brown with the basketball. Drives in against Wilson. Gets out to Fisher. Hesitation move. Drives in. Goes up from short range. Goes in and goes out. Gursky with the rebound. Out to Smith. 33-26. Long shot from Gursky off the mark. There's Rupe Wilson with the ball. Uh, shot off the mark. Trucking it down is Pearson. Use the ball behind his back and then 
They try to get away from the defensive pressure. From the uh, really no pressure on him. Just put the ball behind his back, lost control of it. Unforced turnover by the Hamsters. Can't do that against the Wildcats. Here's Dixon. Goes in. He wanted to go coast to coast with a jam. Misses it. There's a pass underneath. But kick it out. The Pearson for long shot. And saving for going out of bounds was Brown, but right in the hands of Ulysses Tide Williams. And a foul called on the Hamsters. 33 26, Wildcats by seven. Second half action here for the Brick Palace. Wilson will inbounds, uh, Williams will inbounds off to our left. Dixon will reset back down. Rupe Wilson will re enter. Rupe Wilson with the basketball. It's Kanye Taylor. And he'll drive in and go from the right hand and the left hand and scoring is. It's Kanye Tater. Back up to a nine point lead, equals the biggest lead at nine, 35 to 26. Left hand shot, in and out, no good. Williams with a rebound. Loses control of it momentarily, picks it off off the hardwood. Leaves his way out of backcourt. Now it goes up the left hand runner, uses the window, and hits Todd Williams, gets his first deuce of the night. 37 26, now the biggest lead at 11. By the Wildcats, cut off on the baseline. Was Brown, gets underneath to Fisher who scores. Fisher leading score now with 16. 37-28. Wildcats turnover. And Fisher will bring the ball out of backcourt. He'll give it up to Pearson. Gets it in the paint to Burrell, has to get rid of it. Now does, and then the interest pass jabbed away. Turnover by Brown. Long pass down, look out, Kanye Tater. Slip into a slam jam, Kanye Tater with two hands. Kanye Tater having a good night. 39 to 28, back up to 11 point bowl. Here's Burrell, leaves it short. Wilson rebound, long pass down to Williams. Ball deflected, but Williams will track it down in the far corner. The inches pass hit the rim. Tracked down, held by Gersky, will fade away from 12. Air ball. And he gets a little ribbing from Burrell as he comes out of backcourt to Gersky. Here's Fisher working against the defense of Williams. And, and uh, Williams said he didn't touch it. Williams said he did. Trey Fisher, Trey Fisher said he did. Whether he did or not, referees call it Hamster's ball. And he inbounds to Brown. Near angle three. No good by Blackmore. Kanye Tater. He's the Wildcats leading it 39 to 28 by 11. Here's Wilson. Sizing one up, leaves it short. Kahana with the rebound. Coming out of that court is Pearson. I think a swipe at it from behind was Isaiah Smith. Gets out for Fisher, leaves air ball. Inbounds to Kahana off that shot. to try to get out to Brown and intercepted by, by Cardi Taylor. Get down to Wilson, goes up to the right hand and the left hand. He lifts to Todd Williams. He scores his fourth point. And it's 41 to 28. Wildcats now, their biggest lead is at 13 with 12.42 to go. Here's a long pass down after steal. Here's Cherry picking his Todd Williams who scores a six point. All in the second half, 43 to 28. 15 point lead. Here's Fisher, goes in. Reverse lane is good by Trey Fisher. And back the other way quickly is Williams. 45 to 30, 15 point lead. Here's Kahana missing the shot. You gonna turn into showtime here in a hurry. Here's Kanye, here's a Rupe Wilson missing the shot. Tater will grab the rebound. Back out to Rupe Wilson on the baseline. Serves it back out for a near angle three by Kanye Tater. He hits the ripple and the triple Kanye Taylor. 
That'd be a big, big night. 48 to 30. Biggest lead now is at 18. At 48 to 30. Shot underneath, no good. Gursky with the rebound. Brings it out of backcourt. Gives it to Kanye Tater. He'll just kind of just bulldoze his way in and draw the foul. This is where you see here in the second half a lot of is where the Wildcats just, just flat out just wear you down. Just wear you down. And especially uh, running up and down the floor. Fortune. Talking with Kanye Taylor. Kanye Tater will bend flex and hit the free throw. Eighteen points for Kanye Taylor. Forty-nine to thirty. Biggest lead of the uh, the night, and the next one is good. Fifty to thirty. The biggest lead now is at twenty. But Tim. Minutes and 34 seconds to go. Burrell for the baseline, back out to Brown. Get it in to Kahana, feeds it back out to the outside side of Castillo. He'll launch one, in and out no good. Gursky with a good defensive uh, inbound. Yeah, good. A good position to get inbound, yikes. All right, and Tyus Smith with the basketball. He'll just flat out lose control of the basketball, turn it over. And the Wildcats lead it by 20. 50 to 30 at the break. It was 31 to 22, a nine point Wildcat lead. They've been on a little bit of run here in the second half and wearing down the PB hamsters as uh, Timber Brown will bring in the front court. Here's Castillo, trapped in the corner, gives it to Kahana. He'll fire one up, may have been deflected by Jameer Johnson who comes in. Viofi also has come back in. He'll bring the ball down the back court. He'll skid to a stop, and Kahana turns it back, goes up to the weak right hand, and it hits. Tonight, Viofi his first two in the second half. 52 to 30 now. Here's Brown. Who uses the window? Can't get that one to fall. Viofi will yank down the rebound. Long pass down for Kanye Tater. Can't save it from going out of bounds. The pass led Kanye, uh, Rupe Wilson rather, just a little bit too far. Turnover by the Wildcats, leading it by 22. 52 to 30. With time running down here in the second half. This is a special presentation. Uh, Park and Rick. Basketball here from the Brick Palace on AM 1400 KITZ. And on ISPNSports.com. Long shot off by Airball. Broadcast wind bound swing from her left to her right. Todd Williams takes left, goes right. Nice move. Goes to the right hand, gets bumped and is fouled. And he'll find himself back in the free throw line with the Wildcats leading at 20. 52 to 30 by 22 points here in the second half. A little pause of the action is that this is Todd Williams. Herman High, 2006. at the free throw line. He's got six points. Can't convert the first free throw. Next free throw and pinning by Todd Williams. You bend flex and hit the next free throw. Seven points for Ulysses Todd Williams, a 2006 Birmingham tonight. Here's wide open as Pearson going in and can't get the lane to fall. Kenny Biofi will yank down the rebound. That's a Drew Johnson, dumps him down. From the baseline to Viofi, patrolling on the baseline, hands it off to Kanye Tater, who elevates and is fouled on the play. Good ball movement, interior passing by the Wildcats. And once again, Kanye Tater will find himself at the free throw line. Kanye Tater having a big, big night, by the way, but he had eight points at the, he had 10 points at the break, I do believe, going back to me, refer back to my Kanye Tater. He had eight points at the break. Has 18 points now at the game. And he hits the free throw. Hits them both. 55 to 30, 25 point lead, the biggest length now by the Wildcats. Well, the Hamsters, they hung in with a, for a while. 
But just the, con the Wildcats just a little bit too tough here tonight. Here's Brown. One hand runner off the mark, Jameer Johnson. We yanked down a rebound, 2016 Bermington Knight. Without out to 2006 Bermington Knight. This is Todd Williams showing his dribbling skills to get it up to Roop Wilson. Roop Wilson. Fires for long range, nothing but the bottom of that for Roop Wilson. His second three in the night, seven points for him. 58 to 30 now, it's 28 point lead. At a Wildcats, Song shot off the mark by Trey Fisher. 2000, uh, I wanna say 21 or 22. North Mason Bulldog, here's Kanye Tater for three. The ripple and the triple for Kanye Tater. That'd be a big, big night, Kanye Tater. 61 to 30, lead now is Came up big in a hurry to 31 points with under six minutes to go, 5.50 to go here before we wind down here. We take a break now. This is by HK Insurance. We are here for you. When you find yourself in need of insurance, you ask yourself, where do I go? Who's the best? Who's the most affordable? If this is you, your questions have been answered. HK Insurance. HK Insurance is an independent insurance agency specializing in customized policies. They represent a variety of different insurance companies who offer comprehensive packages at affordable prices, like Kemper, Travelers, and Pemco. HK Insurance has three locations: Silverdale, Port Orchard, and in Bremerton. To see how HK Insurance can assist you, call 360-377-7645. HK Insurance, we're here for you. Stress symptoms can affect your body, your thoughts, feelings, and behavior without realizing it. Stress that is left unchecked can contribute to health problems. At Manette Day Spa, our highly trained massage expert therapist can recognize problem areas to ease away everyday stress with a variety of massage methods. You owe it to your body. Call Manette Day Spa to book your appointment today. 360-405-0293. All right, as a matter of fact, on the 27th, I go in for my uh, my treatment at Manette Day Spa. Hey, they have the uh, Halloween special facials right now you can get at Manette Day Spa. They have, they have all the, the special stuff they put on your face for facials. Uh, they'll do it in the uh, Halloween-type uh, atmosphere, like a pumpkin or whatever, right? Here's Brown sneaking in, dumps one down underneath. Out to Trey Fisher, works his way in, splits the finish, goes up with the shot, leaves it short. Here's Dixon with the rebound. Comes into front court. Now drives in right hand, goes up the left hand, bump, fouled, and hits the shot. Deontay Dixon, a big shot. Just a big night for Deontay Dixon. His first points in the second half, however. Wildcats lead it now by 33. 63 to 30. You're listening to Wildcats basketball, Park and Rec style in the Brick Palace and AM 1400, KITZ. Summercast at ISBNSports.com where you can watch the video. But the first half is pretty good. GB Hamsters, well, they, they've fallen to the ways of a lot of teams that play the Wildcats just when the second half rolls around. The Wildcats show their athleticism and, and fitness and duration of being able to outdistance themselves from teams in the end. 63 to 3 means a score. Dixon misses the free throw. Ball jabbed away, steal by Roop Wilson. Here's the LDU, goes up for Kanye, or for Roop Wilson. Hits a shot up, the assist by Dixon. 65 to 30. Current, uh, Roop Wilson gets his fifth point of the, at the second half. Here's Brown spinning in. Nice pass underneath. Step back goes up. There's Jameer Johnson to swat the ball out of bounds. Jameer Johnson coming in at 6'6, 2016. Bremerton Knight. Getting, uh, ricking out some of that uh, off season, so to speak. Shout out to Mark. Rebound pulled down by Blackmore. Foul called. And um, it will be the PB Hamsters basketball. I forgot to ask at halftime what the actually PB stands for. Here's uh, Burrell for three and got it. First point of the night for Kevin Burrell. Closes the gap. Here's Gursky. Tried to dump underneath to Jameer Johnson. Ball jabbed away. Off the hands of uh, PB. 
Jofi wouldn't bounce. Nice pass to Gursky underneath. This is a shot. Gets his own rebound and sticks it back in. Gursky. Seven points for Marquise. Three minutes to go here in the second half. Here is Burrell near side. We're going to do the defense of Burrell. He'll work him. Missed a shot, however, and Bielfi will track down the rebound and come out of backcourt. Going coast to coast. Finds Gursky on the baseline. Fires out to Wilson. Drives in from the far baseline. Misses the shot. Gets his own rebound. He'll peel back out. Gets out to Gursky. Finds Jameer Johnson out on the perimeter. To Wilson. To Bielfi for three. In and out. No good. Brown will track down the rebound and come out of backcourt. Nice bounce pass inside to Blackmore, who scores for his first two points in the second half. Yes, four in the game. 67 to 35. With 218 to go here in this one. And a present presentation of Park and Rec basketball for Wildcast basketball. Takes it for three. In and out. Blackmore with the rebound. Brown out of backcourt. Left hand dribble. Cut out there by Dixon. On the baseline. Fires underneath. Nice return pass to Brown, who can convert out the nice pass underneath by Blackmore. And here's Whoop Wilson on the other end to score for the Wildcats. Six, nine, 11, 13 points for Group Wilson. 69 to 35, but a buck 40 to go here in this one. 17 footer off the mark by Pearson. Air ball. And uh, that guy's kind of tall, but <laughs> just walked by our video camera. He looks about 6'7 or more. Here's Dixon. Jab stepping. Now a drive in. His ball jabbed away momentarily. Just fling one up. And a foul called. And then the exact uh, the exasperation on the face of. The uh, hamsters is um, nothing has gone their way here in the second half. Dixon shooting two. Brian Striggy, the referee, I'll to see him during baseball for a uh, high school and college baseball. Brian Striggy. When I was broadcasting the kids at Blue Jackets baseball, he was out there doing some of those games as well, and Olympic College. And he shot up and in. <laughs> 71 to 35. We have 19 seconds to go. He's driving in is Burrell, and he uses the window and hits. Five points in the second half for, for Burrell. 71 to 37. As Gursky will wind out the clock with four, the three, the two, and Viofi will just launch from it the buzzer. And that will be your final here from the, the Brick Palace. Your score, your final score, the Wildcats 71, the Hamsters 37. We'll get uh, Roop Wilson, number eight, and uh, number three, uh, Todd Williams. is our post-game players of the game. We come back here on video. Stick around. The two players here on uh, radio, we will call it a day. And if you want to watch the post-game video, go to ISPN Sports to watch replay, and we'll have uh, it on YouTube as well for the entire game and the post-game interview with Rupe Wilson and Todd Williams. From that, we'll do it from here. Your final score once again is the Wildcats 71 going away against the Hamsters 37. You've been listening to a special sports presentation of Park and Rec Basketball, exclusively on ISPNSports.com. Heard around the world, the rebroadcast, dissemination, reproduction, or transmission of this copyrighted broadcast without prior written consent from ISPN Sports is strictly prohibited.